much. A beautiful day here in Orlando, Florida. A little chilly, a little cold, but that's okay, no problem. The, the sun is out, the sky is blue, it is all good. And we have a very special guest joining us on today's show. Skateboarding sensation, one of the best skateboarders in all the world. Bucky Lastic is here, what's up? How you doing, bud? <laughs> Welcome to the show, man. I love the story about how you got your start skateboarding. How you got you started skateboarding so many years ago. Your microphone's not working, so oh, now it's working. Tell us how you got started skateboarding. I got started, my bike got ripped off, and I got a skateboard for uh, Christmas. So you, you might have been a professional biker if it, if it didn't get going. Yeah, I might have been Matt Hoffman. Right, but instead you became Bucky. Bucky. Last? Bucky. All right, Bucky, come on over here with me. Check this out. We got the mail matic Now, Joan is out of town. He's gone on his little Nick venture, so Sarah's going to help us out. Sarah, we had a lot of trouble with the rhymes yesterday. Let's see if we can get a rhyme to go. All right, listen, I wrote this one myself. I can't believe all the pie Jonah ate. He's pretty good, but Dave is... Very good. Great! We were going for great, but very good. I'll take that anyway. Hey, Sarah, you want a pie in the face? Yes. You want Bucky to do it? Bucky, hook her up with a pie in the face. Your first ever pie on Slam Talk. Go ahead. Bang! Oh, ho, ho. like a professional. All right, guys, now we're going to go back behind me over there because we need you all to log on to Nick.com. Who should we slam first? Should it be Matthew? Should it be Andrew? Or should it be Siobhan? One of them will be getting slammed. It's up to you to vote at Nick.com. One more thing to do, like we don't have enough going on. Hand that in over here. We're going to start a new tradition this season on Slime Time. Every time we get a special guest in the house, they're going to sign this bucket for us. All right, Bucky, in four seconds or less, just start signing it. We'll, we'll finish it later. Here comes the Rugrats. He's going to sign the, the bucket. Time to decide what's going in the mystery bucket, and Andrea's going to help us out. She's on the phone. Hi, Andrea. Hi, Dave. Hi. Do you want to see honey, yeah. seaweed, or rotten eggs? Which one? Honey. The honey is going to the mystery bucket. The first round's coming up. Well, we are finally ready to play the first round of Slime Time Live 2002 for today. And up in the mystery bucket is honey. Bucky, you have not yet seen the slime in full effect, but that could be happening momentarily. I'm waiting. You're about to find out why we call it slime time. I'm a little nervous. No, don't worry. This is not meant for you. You'll, you'll be okay. Yeah, you'll be fine. But you are in control of that button right there, which makes the slime come down. Now we have Danielle on a telephone. She lives in Peekskill, New York, up in the mountains. Hey, Danielle. Hi. How are you? Awesome. Awesome. I know you have a question you wanted to ask Bucky about skateboarding. Go ahead. Um, how do you keep your feet on the board when you jump in the air? Well, what happens is uh, you kind of you kind of apply pressure in certain areas, and it, you kind of carry it with you. So if that answers your question, kinda, there you go. It has some grip tape on top, so it kind of catches your shoe a little. Ow. Cool. All right. Well, thank you for that. And Danielle, you ready to meet your teammates so we can play the first round? Yep. All right, sweet. Bucky, stay here. Man that button right there. This man is one of the best skateboarders in the world, by the way. So when he talks about it, he knows what he's doing. All right. Danielle, your teammate, again, thanks to all the voters out there at Nick.com, is Matthew in the gold, sporting the gold uniform today. So we got Danielle, we got Matthew, we got our first team of stars, and they are each going to try and win this grand prize right here. A vertical 26-inch, 21-speed PK7 bike with aluminum frame and dual suspension, distributed by Dynacraft. I understand, Matthew, you've been working on a rhyme for us. Go ahead. How much wood can a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? That is a real rhyme. Yes, I've heard it. Well said. All right, you ready to get slime? Yes. Good. Well, then send them back. Let's play slime time. Danielle, we're looking for heifer on the game board. You're going to have three chances to find the two heifer characters that are going to be right next to each other, either side to side, top to bottom, or diagonally. If you can do it, Bucky's going to hit the button. We're going to dump the slime. Good luck. And... Go now. Three and six. Three and six. Chucky and SpongeBob. Try it again. Seven and eight. Seven and eight is the Cream Blaster and Doug. So hang on right there. Okay, come on, guys. Help me. Three, two, one. Blast. <laughs> Danielle, this is your last chance. Remember, we're looking for Heifer. Give me two more numbers. One and four. One and four is a win. You did it on your last shot. Go ahead, Bucky. Hit that button, and here it comes. Here comes the slime, and here comes the mystery bucket filled with honey. A little slime and a little honey. Keep the bees away. Danielle and Matthew each got a grand prize. More slime time after this. Hey, guys, it's Dave and Jessica. Round Hi. two with an all-new mystery mess is coming up. But first, a little treat for these guys. Bucky is going to skate slime time style, right? Yes, it is our slime time pie course. 
Bucky, that you're gonna have to go through these obstacles right here, but while you're doing it, you're gonna have to pie these guys in the face. Let's see if you can do it. I think you can. Ready, set, go, Bucky. All right, can you handle it? One, two, and oh, with a little attitude on that one. Oh, with the bonus. Wow. Nice shot, Jessica. Round two is live time coming up. How's that taste? Pretty good. Hey guys, what's happening today? Days we're here for more Slime Time Live and the uh, daily. Hold on a second. A chew! Oh man! A chew! Oh man! Oh sinuses, man. Anyway, like I was saying, the Daily Nick U-Pig is going to be coming up real soon. You know the J-Man's on his afternoon, Nick Ventures. We want to find out what you guys do in the afternoon. Send us an email at nickventures at nick.com. Tell us what it is. Maybe Jonah will hook up with you. I'm going to try this rhyme thing one more time. Jamie's on the phone. Let's see if we can do it, Jamie. Finally. Jonah's on the road in his Nick Venture van. He called to say that Dave is the... Oh. No, man. Oh, I give up. Nick.com, who are we going to vote for? Who should we slime? Should it be Cassie? Should it be Ryan? Or should it be Matt? Log on and vote. Our first round of slime time worked so well, we thought we would do it again. So uh, that's exactly what we're going to do right now. We're going to hopefully dump some more slime. In case you guys are just joining us, our special guest today, Bucky Lassig is here. Hi. Hi. Two-time gold medalist, Burt champion skateboarder, pretty much the king of all things right now. And he's here hanging out with us, ready to help us dump some more slime. We have Nicole on the telephone from Liverpool, New York. Hey, Nicole. Hi. Nicole, what's your question for Bucky? Um, is it hard to like keep your balance on the board? Well, that's kind of the learning process you go to, you go through. Uh, you learn how to stand up on it, and you learn how, you eventually learn how to do tricks. And I guess it can be very hard for some people. I kind of learned quick. My answer to that is yes, it is very hard for me. All right, hang here. Nicole, come on over with me, because we're going to get you your teammate. Again, thanks to all the voters at Nick.com. And the player going to the chair for this round is right in the middle. Come on, it's Ryan wearing blue. I want to thank our other two contestants, but we got Ryan, we got Nicole, we got our next team, and we got this grand prize that is up for grabs. Here you go. A vertical 26-inch, 21-speed PK7 bike with aluminum frame and dual suspension, distributed by Dynacraft. Ryan has a little rhyme for you guys. What's your rhyme? I, ha I had a rhyme, but I don't have time. <laughs> All right, I can't argue with that. We don't have the time for a rhyme. Send it back. Let's play slime time. Nicole, we are looking for Cat Dog on our game board. Three chances to find Cat Dog, but you gotta find him right next to himself, I guess. Either side to side, top to bottom, or diagonally. If you do it, we give away the prizes. We dump the slime and we hit the mystery bucket, which by the way has motor oil in it. That could be gross. Alright, Nicole, ready, go! Eight and six. Eight and six is Helga and Cat Dog. Go again. Six and nine. Six and nine is Cat Dog and Cat Dog. We're gonna see what motor oil looks like. Hit that button. Here comes the slime. Here comes motor oil. Nasty. More slime time is coming up after this. Could it get any nastier? I don't know. We're about to play a little game here on Slime Time, but first things first, I wanted to show you some of our audience just taking pies to the face from other audience members. No whole part around here. Everyone is eligible to be pied and to do some pie. All right, the name of the game we're gonna play is called Name That Goose. This is Joseph, he's our volunteer. Joseph, here's how this one works. You got 10 seconds to figure out what's in here. So take your hand in there right there, I'll give you some clues, 10 seconds. It's an underwater plant. It grows kind of like a weed. It's found in the sea, not sea grass, but seaweed is absolutely right. Congratulations, you just won a prize. You want me to tell you what you want? The prize is an all expense paid trip to seaweed on your head. There you go, congratulations. And there's plenty more where that came from. We're gonna play a brand new game. It's called Honey, I'm Home, and it's coming up pretty soon. More of your you pick winner. You are looking at world champion skater Bucky Lassick doing an amazing skateboarding trick. But Bucky, Bucky, it would be a little more impressive if you, if you had this. That'd make it a little. Practicing. I was practicing. All right. Well, that, that would be really impressive if you could pull that one up. I'll so, try it later. All right. We'll work on that one. All right. So check this out, Bucky. I'm going to pop back here. All right. So come on back here with me. We're going to play our first of three elimination rounds today before the Super Sloppy Slime Off. This is another one of our brand new, never, ever before played games. We've got some busy little bees up here. This game is called Honey, I'm Home. And over here on the red team, we have Krista 
and Andy taking on the blue team with Frank and Robin. Here's how this game's gonna play out. Behind us here, we have the beehives, and their beehives have some uh, balloons on them filled with honey-flavored goo. So why don't you come on back here, check it out, see how it looks. They've also got some stingers on their on their beehives back here. And when we say go, these bees are going to try and bust the balloons with the stingers. Whichever team busts all the balloons first, they win. They move on to the slime up. Ready, set, go! Use those stingers. Bust them all. You got to get every single balloon. Jessica's counting for the red team. Matt's counting up for the blue team. The blue team has one back here. They got to work on back here. Looks like they got to get the red team's done. Red team wins. Red wins. Red team, they have won. They will be playing in the Big Shabuzi, the game formerly known as the Super Sloppy Slime Up. They'll be playing in it. We got more slime time still to come right after this. I know you guys aren't going to move. Nuh-uh. Stay here. Now back to slime time, right here on Nickelodeon. Welcome back to Slime Time Live. Bucky Lassick in the house today. We want to Hi. let you guys know how you can be part of Slime Time. You can either join us here in person at Nick Studios in Orlando, Florida, or you can send us a postcard with your name, age, address, and phone number to Slime Time Live, PO Box 4845, Orlando, Florida, 32802. In addition to telling them all that stuff, uh, if you could, could you give them some advice uh, for any future skateboarders out there about you know what it takes or what you think they should do? Well, I definitely advise you to wear your safety gear because you're gonna fall a lot when you're beginning, and uh, I advise you to buy you know my signature series shoe and my signature series. Nice. <laughs> Very nice, nice plug right there. SpongeBob is coming up. We That's come SpongeBob. back. SpongeBob. Yes, and SpongeBob, a uh, classic elimination game. So Baker of Whipped Cream Pies, he is the pie man for this particular game. You guys might recognize it. It is a Slime Time Classic. It is time for us to, uh, well, I, 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 think I, uh, I think I messed that one up. Let's try that again. It's a Slime, slime time, time Classic. classic. Yeah. I was supposed to do that the first time. It was going to sound really cool. <laughs> my, my bad. Sorry. Anyway, it's called Musical Pies. And our players are in a nice little neat line. We have Steven, Katie, and Rachel, Vicky, and Aaron. You guys go ahead and stand in a circle right now. We're gonna play some music, pass some pies around. If you're holding a pie when the game is over or when the music stops, you're out, your game is over. Last two people standing, move on for the big shoe. You ready? Let's do it. Pass it around, Invader Zim music. Oh, back there. Right back there, one over. Pie yourself in the face, there you go. All right, let's keep playing, guys. Keep it going. Last two people stand, and they win. They move on to play the big music. Come on. Right here. Yeah, good job. All right, last one. Got to eliminate one more player. This guy right here. Oh, beautiful. Show everyone. Show your face. Show everyone there. All right, so these two players have won. Want to say goodbye to Bucky Lassick. Thanks for coming by, Buck. See you later, Buck. You're watching the Slime Time Live, and we are getting ready for our third and final elimination round. It's going to be out of this world, right, Micah? Right! What kind of balloons are we buying? No. Okay, well, the balloon didn't pop. Coming up, our elimination round that you're not going to want to miss because it's brand new and it's really, really Slime Time Live. 2002. This is Mike. A few minutes ago, we tried to slime him, but we couldn't get the balloon to pop. So Tracy is going to help us out. Tracy works as uh, one of the audience coordinators. And by the way, Tracy, happy birthday. <laughs> it's Tracy's birthday today. So you know we had to give her a little bit of slime on her head. Yes. You and Micah, a magic pair. How cute. Thanks, Mike. Good job over there. All right, now we're ready to play our final elimination round for today so we can have all of our players ready for the big shibuzi. This is another brand new game. Hang on, come back here, come back, come back, come back, come back. Not yet, but I like, I like the enthusiasm. This one's called Meteor Shower. And over here on the blue team, we have Toby and Kayla taking on the red team with Christian and Sydney. Okay, now you guys can move. Here's how this one works. We're gonna start spinning these guys around on their rocket ships. Those guys over there are gonna have 30 seconds to fire as many of these meteors covered with goos and slime and stuff over at their rocket ship. Now, whichever team can break more of these balloons after 30 seconds, they win. They move on to the Shibuzi. Ready, set, go! Let's see the aim we got here. You're trying to break those meteors. Hit that rocket ship, and you know, if you want to hit your teammates, feel free, go ahead. Plenty of time left. 
We're going for the underhanded softball style right now, I'm noticing. And it's not working over here on the red team, I don't Jess, they might need to go for the overhand yeah. baseball style. Yeah, she just needs a second, I think. You point. only got five seconds left. Uh, Three, two, one, out of time. That's it, Matt, how many? We have two over here. We have two on the blue. Jessica, how many? Zero. Zero, Sorry. which means two to zero. Blue <laughs> wins the game. Blue team wins. They're headed to the Shibuzi and a little bit of bonus. Slime for them, too. Rocket power. Speaking of rocket ships, that's going to be coming up in a while. But you know, we're going to make a whole bunch more mess, so don't move. Hey, Jess, what are you doing? I'm mixing this stuff up here. We got the honey, the slime, the whipped cream, because we're putting it in the Shibuzinator. Did you just call me honey? <laughs> I try. Here's yeah. Rocket Power. The all new Shabuz of Blender. We're taking the ingredients from our elimination games today and we're mixing them up. We're going to use them in the big Shabuzi. I like this, Jess. I like this. A I lot. do too. It's honey, whipped cream, and slime. Yeah. Which still makes slime just a lighter color. It always turns out great. <laughs> it's no matter... always great. We can mix purple. And it would still look great. It would still look great. Well, the, the big Shibuzi is coming up next. These guys are working very hard. Guys, well done. Hey, listen, if you want, we can dump some of this on you guys if you want. I think we might have some extras. I think we might have to do They're it. not listening yeah, to they're you. Not. They're not. They're into their work. Like, whatever. Whoa. Welcome once again to the Slime Beauty Show. Maybe, arguably, in the history of television. Slime Time Live. I'm Dave Azer, and a very slimy day has come down to this, the big Shibuzi. And today from the Shibuzinators, we're going to be dumping a mixture of honey, whipped cream, and slime. So we'll see how that looks when it lands on the heads of our players. But before we can dump any of that stuff, we have to talk to the two players on the telephone who are going to be answering all the questions. And today we have Jason taking on Samantha. Hey, Jason. Jason. Yeah. There you are. How you doing, man? Good. You got any energy? Let me hear you. Are you doing good? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, your team is standing next to Matt wearing the blue. All right. Take it on Jessica's team, represented by Samantha. Hi, Samantha. Hey. Hey. How are you doing? Good. Good. Samantha, here's your side over here in red. Okay. Guys, your topic today for the Big Shibuzi is things you might find on a pizza. I'm going to give you some clues about different ingredients and stuff that you put on a pizza. Hit your buzzer when you know it. I'll call on you. If you get it right, same drill as before. Whipped cream pie in the face for someone on your team. If you get it wrong or if you just don't say anything, then a whipped cream pie in the face for someone on the other team. Whichever team is the very first team that gets three fives on three faces, they win the game, and each member of the team, including you on the phone, wins this prize right here. A vertical 26-inch, 21-speed PK7 bike with aluminum frame and dual suspension distributed by Dynacraft. Yeah, they get that, but not only that, they're going to get a whole lot of other stuff. For example, whipped cream cannons fired at their faces, Booty Blasters are going to hit them from behind, the all-new Booty Blasters. And then, like I said, on top of their heads, a mixture of honey, whipped cream, and slime, about 15 gallons worth. All right, come on, everybody, let me hear you. Let's play the Big Shibuzi. I know some of you guys at home are saying the super sloppy slime off. It's okay, it's going to take you a little while to get used to it. Don't feel bad, just practice it tonight before you go to bed. Just practice saying the Big Shibuzi. I had to do that. All right, here we go. Things you might find on a pizza. Hit your buzzer when you know it. This is the first one. It is melted white stuff. It's made of milk. The kind on pizza is called mozzarella. It starts with a C-H. Samantha! Is it cheese? Cheese. What is cheese? Yes. There's one for the red side. Nice pie-ish. OK, one nothing red. This is a thick red liquid. It's usually under the cheese. Who got there, Samantha? Sauce. Sauce, two for two. Well on your way. Samantha, you must be a pizza eater, huh? Yeah. All right, Jason, you eat pizza? Yeah. You put any toppings on your pizza? Yeah. All right, let's see if you can find some of these toppings. These are round reddish slices of meat. Who got there first? Who was it? The buzzers, Jason. Pepperoni. Pepperoni. You're back in the ball game. One for you. This is also sliced meat, but it's brown. It's also spicy. 
Jason. Meat bomb. No. Sausage. So another buy for the red team. Three buys. They win. Whipped cream cannons. Booty blasters. And here comes the honey whipped cream and slime concoction. Oh, how colorful. And of course, grand prize is also for everyone on the red team. Matt, get them. Give them some stuff, will you? All right, guys, we are out of here. Thanks again to Bucky Lassick for joining us today. We'll see you all tomorrow. Have a good night. Do your homework, eat your vegetables, all that stuff. Be back tomorrow. We'll see you then. Later.